Virginia Tech heads to Boston College ACC showdown. This one's 11 a.m. Central Time, God's Time Zone, on the ACC Network. Boston College now a one and a half point dog at home, total of 49 on this one. And we'll pull this thing up. Full season numbers have got Boston College favored by 2.35. Now, this might be a bit of a letdown spot because Boston College did get bowl eligible last week. Virginia Tech is still fighting to get there. So, motivation may be in favor of Virginia Tech. Uh, but you start to look at these full season numbers. Uh, number 68 in PPA margin for BC. Number 80 for Virginia Tech. The BC offense, actually pretty good on the year. Uh, not great passing the ball, but, you know, they are explosive. Uh, the Virginia Tech defense does not allow explosive passes. Uh, but they do allow explosive runs. And Thomas, uh, Thomas Castellanos, uh, the quarterback for BC, like, he leads that rushing game. Uh, you saw it against Syracuse last week. But, you know, Virginia Tech, number 45 in rushing success rate allowed, but they're number 122 in rushing explosiveness allowed. On the other side, of course, We've got a really bad BC defense, especially against the pass. Uh, Drones, the new quarterback for Virginia Tech, not great throwing the ball, uh, but it is what it is. Now, these are full season numbers. Let's, uh, let's go in and swap it over, and let's look at the last four weeks. And Boston College, an even bigger favorite here, uh, number 15 in PPA margin against number 26. These are two pretty good teams, and I think a lot of this switched based on what happened to Virginia Tech last week, because those numbers got out of hand pretty quick. Uh, Boston College has played a, uh, a much easier schedule, we'll say. Uh, you start looking at net explosiveness. Neither one of these teams very explosive over the past four weeks. PC number 117, Virginia Tech number 125 in net explosiveness. Um, both teams not great as far as points per play on offense, uh, but really good on defense. So I wouldn't expect a ton of points here. There's a reason why this total is at 49 on this. My projected total over the past four weeks is like 40 and a half. Uh, we'll see, though, because, it, yes, these are opponent-adjusted, but how much can you adjust based on the fact that Virginia Tech's played some tougher teams and Boston College has played uh, a Syracuse team that fell off and UConn and et cetera, right? So I look at this, and these are two pretty good teams. Virginia Tech significantly better at stopping the run now than they were. Uh, but I I think that I'm going to have to go with Boston College at home. Even with the motivation being in Virginia Tech's favor, uh, I will take BC as the home dog on that one. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and follow me on Twitter, at GaryWCE. If you want to toss in a question... You can email me, Gary, at winningcureseverything.com. Make sure and hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.